Okay, so here we are. Here's the street that you would come down. You would come from this direction here, coming this way. <laughs> There's a house here. It's kind of hard to see with the sun, but it's at the end of a little tiny cul-de-sac here. Well, there's a nice car. I wonder if it's for sale. Um, so here's the front of the house. Got a little RV gate over here on the side. Let's get in the shade here so we can see a little better. Little RV gate right here. So let's go in the front entry. Walk in, there's a staircase. Immediately to your right, you have a dining room, slash family room, living room, fireplace, more of a sitting area probably. Over here, uh, back to the staircase. Over here to your left, you're going to have the master bedroom. This is going into the bathroom. So, dual sinks. All they have in here is a stand up shower. And you got a door to the outside. Then you got a mirror with some stud in it. Uh, this is your walk-in closet. Okay. Come back out. Now this door leads out to the garage and it's right next to the front entry. So there's the door to the garage. Here's a downstairs bathroom. And it's got some odd sliding doors in here, like it used to be a big closet. Yeah, that's a decent sized closet. Okay. And we're still back at the front entry. Gonna go into the kitchen. This is a living room type of area. Okay. Uh, the depth isn't, it's not real deep. The depth is only one, two, three, four yards. So that's about 12 feet by one, two, three, four, five yards, which is about 15 feet. So 12 by 15, it's not huge, but it's a rental. <laughs> Here's your kitchen. It's got a little desk <clears throat> option thing here, which is kind of odd. But here's your kitchen area with a little nook. Okay. Kitchen goes all the way back to there. And then back here you've got a pantry. Or, sorry, laundry room. This would be more of your pantry here. Okay, let's head outside. Ah, uh, yes. For the two months that you're here, you will be able to enjoy the pool. Get your water slide, and you got your diving board, and you got your hoop. And then over here, in case you need to stay six months and you get to the winter months, there's your hot tub. Pretty nice back patio, and there's uh, obviously, as you can see, there's no neighbors over there. Back inside, now we're going to head upstairs. Now the good thing about this rental is, too, is that they are wide open for as much as you need, however long as you need. Just a little empty area here, I don't know what that's for. Walk this way, here's the guest bath, dual sinks, 
there's a tub area. The bathroom is one, two, three, about three and a half yards. So does that make that about 10, 12 feet or 10, 11 feet? Pretty nice. Nice Ikea work. And you got a bedroom here. And this bedroom is one, two, three, four, twelve feet by one, two, three, four, twelve by twelve. Little closet. Back out. Here's the other bedroom. Gonna be about the same dimensions, twelve by twelve. It's a closet. Head in here is another bedroom. It's a little dark in here. Let me get this light on. Or not. Uh, this this bedroom is going to be a little bit bigger. This one looks it's more like one. Two. This one's more like twelve by fifteen. So that's what we're looking at there. And then you've got this doohickey over here, which is a office slash den slash bedroom, except for the fact that it's got this big open area right here on the wall to where you can actually see down below. So kind of odd, but You'll see these from time to time. But that's it, pretty much in a nutshell. Um, so let us know what you guys think. We said this is a rental option for you guys. Uh, it's very clean. It's very clean, very move-in ready. Um, you can move right into this, and the agent is pretty much ready to roll. So let us know what you guys think. And we will go from there. So, Nina, one more luck. One more luck. All righty. We'll talk to you later. Let us know what you think. See ya. Bye-bye.